I'm Marcia, and my husband and I have Lilac Springs. And I wanted to give you a little history about how we became what we are. In 2008, we uh, met a man from the uh, Veterans Administration, and we started to work with him. We had a few things for veterans, and then we had a, our first breakaway in 2008. And sort of the rest is history. My name is Shinoa, and I attended Lilac Springs with my husband the first time when I was um, about two weeks away from giving birth to my first daughter. When you come for a breakaway, you are meeting other people who feel just like you do and who think like the veterans think, like each other, they can understand each other. Whereas when you're out in the world, some people don't quite understand the difficult things that you go through as being a spouse of a veteran or a veteran themselves. And here you have family, you have friends that you never met before. And it's, it's amazing. My name is Jody, and my daughter and son-in-law attend Lilac Springs quite regularly, actually. First as attendants who needed help, they needed a lot of help, and things were really rough. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> and it saved their lives. It saved all of us. We feel more stable, you know. You feel that we can go on and if things get a little rough again then how about let's let's go out to Lilac Springs and hang out and it helps a lot. <laughs> we don't welcome them home. We try to create a home here at Lilac Springs. And you can see there's veterans that come back. They come back and prepare the meals. They come back to talk. They come back to you know, just for the visiting and the camaraderie. And every community should have uh, a facility or a place like this. So every community should be like this. And um, that's what we've attempted to do. We want to create war literate citizens. Citizens who know um, that these people have been to hell and they're in pain and they don't know how to reconnect. 